And now, your live Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Cameron Hoffman. Weather from where you live. Well, the temperatures peaked about 7 degrees above average for this time of the year. Yesterday, today, a much cooler day. We had a cold front roll on through yesterday afternoon. Uneventful, but cooling things off for today. Secondary cold front on its way for later on this afternoon. That could produce a few isolated showers across the area later on this afternoon. But then things are going to be warming up again by next week. As for right now, it is sitting in the mid 50s, 56 degrees out there. Winds are calm from the northeast, gusting up to near 6 miles per hour. Humidity right now, 96%. And that is because we are dealing with some chances for isolated showers. Down to our south, you can see some rainfall. Now, that's a stalled out cold front that's going to take its time making its way across the area later on this afternoon. Notice the cloud cover beginning to move into the area as well. We're being, we'll be seeing mostly cloudy to partly cloudy skies here over the next 24 hours. So plenty of cloud cover and cool conditions on its way. But let's get a better look at this rain. Turning the precision right now, you can see what we're dealing with is just a couple isolated showers down to our south. And as for the northern portion of the viewing area, we're not going to be seeing a whole lot of rain. But as you turn to the south, this is where you're going to see your best chance for rain. Montgomery County, Fountain Warren counties, maybe be seeing the best chance for rain later on this afternoon. So we're looking at maybe just an isolated chance for showers and looking at future casts. You can see exactly what I'm talking about here. Now the cold front pulls up later on this afternoon, finally making its way out of the area. That'll be your best chance for some rain. About five one hundreds to about a tenth of an inch of rain is what we're expecting here with this system. Now as it pushes on out, we'll be left with some cloud cover, partly cloudy to mostly cloudy skies overnight tonight and into tomorrow morning. Maybe a chance for an isolated shower tomorrow morning, but by the afternoon, things clearing up. We'll be seeing partly cloudy skies tomorrow. Now, since that cold front comes on through today, we're cooling off even more tomorrow. 65 degrees for your high temperature tomorrow, so we're talking temperatures about 15 degrees below average for this time of the year. Definitely cool temperatures out there. As for Friday, though, a high pressure system begins to move into the area. That's going to clear things out for Friday afternoon and also warm things up. Temperatures are going to be about 70 degrees on Friday. So we're warming back up into the 70s. You can call the low 70s warm compared to what we've been seeing here over the last few days. 74 degrees for your high temperature this afternoon in Lafayette. Fowler going to be about 73, 72 for Morocco this afternoon. Overnight tonight, we do cool down to around 45. Degrees, mostly cloudy, brisk conditions overnight tonight and into tomorrow. A high temperature around 65, partly cloudy, maybe a chance for an isolated shower during the morning, but then cooler during the afternoon. Temperatures about 10 to 15 degrees below average for this time of the year. Now we do begin to warm up once again come Friday. A high temperature of around 70 that day. We have that high pressure system that's going to come on in. It's going to help warm things up and clear things out. 76 on Saturday. Sunday going to be about 80. So 76 to 80 degrees. That's about our average high temperature for this time of the year. So we're dipping down to the mid 60s up to around 80 degrees by Sunday. And then we're warming back up into the lower than maybe even the mid 80s by midweek. 82 on Monday, partly cloudy skies both Monday and Tuesday. Maybe a chance for showers Monday. Tuesday looks to be about 85 with four year high temperature. So warming back up. So keep the jacket handy tonight, tomorrow, and bring out the shorts again next week. <laughs> I would say the shorts again next week, but yeah, maybe a light jacket here over the next couple days. All right. Make sure you have that versatile wardrobe, right? Mm -hmm. you're telling us Always. Long sleeve shorts, <laughs> sleeve shorts. Whatever, mixed bag camera things. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Changes every 10 minutes.